Hey, hey, it's Tom with uh, Cedar Mountain Survival. Um, I wanted to get the, uh, this video, uh, just kind of an unboxing video, out of the way so that I can use this. I'm anxious to use it and uh, just was waiting for some time. I'm going to try and get this video in, get uh, some roofers coming to work on the roof uh, here today, installing a new roof, so I'm going to try and get it in before that happens. But this is the uh, SC Fire Steel um, Flint Steel Striker. Um, made by SE's Randall's Adventure Training and Equipment Group and um, I've seen some videos on this um, it's probably not going to be a lot to the unboxing uh, I'm going to do videos to see uh, how it works but um, I have seen videos that seems like it uh, works pretty good so uh, we're just going to this is how it comes just kind of in a plastic container I like the uh, idea that they they put it in a tin that you can use for making char cloth. Um, also keeps it you know nice and compact in, uh, in a tin and protected. But uh, kind of a neat logo they have on the uh, on the front there for the uh, for the flint fire steel. Um, so we'll go ahead and open this up. Looks like it will have to cut it. This has, I don't want to cut it too much because it does have some uh, instructions on the back uh, which I'll read, just some kind of basic knowledge type uh, information on a card in the back which is I guess kind of kind of nice that they do that. You can stick that in a bailout bag or a bug out bag. careful about opening this up, but I'll retain this, this card here, see what that's all about. So, this fire still comes in this tin, nice tin, it's a little bit smaller than an Altoid container, but uh, should work great for char cloth. Um, got the uh, www.jungletraining.com on the on the back there, but uh, it comes with this card. It gives you some information. I'm not going to read uh, all this information, but um, determining distances traveled without a GPS on flat terrain, rough terrain, and steep rough terrain gives you some uh, pace indicators as to how far you've traveled uh, distance-wise, and gives you declinations for magnetic and true north uh, and ground to air distress signals short term survival tips uh, fire building instructions it says uh, about the fire steel the SC knives fire steel is built from 1095 carbon steel is heat treated to be used as fire making tool for the use with true flint and charred material. The edges of the fire steel also work as a ferro rod striker and the center divot is designed to be used as a bow drill socket. The fire drill comes packaged in a hinged lid tin that can be used to make char cloth and other charred materials. So uh, those are one of the reasons I was kind of interested in this was the, uh, the uh, bearing block in the middle of it that can be used, utilized if, with a bow drill. I thought that was kind of Kind of useful and something uh, interesting to have. Looks like the uh, roof, roof the, uh, dumpsters here for the roof construction, and they're uh, busy putting that out uh, out there now. So I'll resume the video. I just want to get this done so that I get to go to work this afternoon, and uh, I'd like to get it done so they can start to use it. But um, so opens right up here. We've got some kind of card on the top, which I'm trying to get out. Tight fit down there. You may hear the uh, delivering the dumpster here in the background, but oh yeah, it comes with a nice little card here. Some of the same information that was on this card: short-term survival tips and ground-to-air distress signals. Uh, yeah, so it's kind of cool. Little card to keep in there, I guess, if you wanted. And card with their information on it. So I guess uh, here's the fire steel piece. I was kind of expecting it to be kind of bigger, but um, I think this is going to be a 
good size because um, it gives you a little bit uh, more flexibility as far as uh, striking. It's not as heavy, and so it's got a, like a little bearing block. You can see in the in the middle there, SC Rowan kind of stamped on the uh, other side there. It's got some you know, sharp edges on the sides here. Plenty of uh, edges to help you get a, a spark. And looks like it probably comes with some instructions back here. It comes with the product description. Gives you some instructions on how to uh, use it with flint and steel and shirt. Uh, tells you how to use the uh, metal container for char cloth. Um, using it as a ferrous seam rod striker and as a bow drill socket. So I'll read through that, but um, it's going to be pretty self explanatory. I just wanted to uh, do the unboxing on that and we'll get to using it. I'll uh, record some of that video and show you how it works. So that's the uh, Reynolds Adventure Training School of Survival uh, SE Fire Steel um, with an integrated bow drill bearing block uh, built into it. So if you uh, like the uh, information and uh, like the description, if you could hit the like and subscribe button for me, I'd appreciate it.